What's up, YouTube? It's your boy, Trucker Doc. Back with another video. Today, we're gonna go ahead, and I need some help from the YouTube community. I need some help from you guys. Um, I'm debating on switching back to drive-in. And that's what we're gonna talk about in today's episode of Trucking with Trucker Doc. Stay tuned. <music> trucker doc back again how is y'all doing so like i said in the intro i'm debating on whether to switch back to drive in or stay refrigerated and i'm gonna let you guys kind of know what the backstory about that is so <clears throat> a couple days ago about maybe three or four days ago you know i told my um my dm that hey I'm going to go ahead and take a 34 hour reset. So they call me. They're like, are you sure you want to do a 34? We're overbooked. Ba -da 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 -da. I'm like, yeah, I'm sure. It's not my problem that you guys are overbooked. I'm low on hours. I don't want to run on my recaps. I'm doing a 34 hour reset. Boom. That's the end. Right. Okay. So from that now I'm finding it hard to get loads. And I don't like that. Um, I go from getting two or three or four pre-plans on me to fighting to get a load after I drop one. So never had that problem in drive van. Another thing is I spend way too much time at a shipper or receiver getting loaded, waiting for a load to get loaded. It's just it's too much whereas drive-in i was on the move you know dropping hooks boom if i was at a shipper or a receiver an hour and a half tops maybe so i need some help from the youtube community community go ahead and comment down below let me know your thoughts um current drivers let me know your thoughts of what you think about reefer compared to drive-in uh let's weigh our options rookie drivers um drivers that's just coming into the game you can get involved in this topic as well look for the comments um if you're thinking about going to refrigerate it pay attention to the comments about the refrigerator to see if that's something you want to do uh drive van as well you know if you have some insight on refrigerated versus drive van go ahead and let me know um but i'm i'm leaning towards switching back to drive van mainly Mainly, sorry, excuse me. Mainly because I I can it's it's less pay, but it's not less pay by much. But I'm constantly moving. It's 100% or about 90% dropping hooks. Um, so that's something that I, I I'm looking for. So go ahead, let me know what you guys think. And. My next video, I'm gonna let you know a decision of what I chose to do, whether it's gonna be reefer or whether it's gonna be drive in. Until then, YouTube, I definitely do wanna thank you for that. Um, I appreciate you guys. Again, go ahead, hit that like, comment, subscribe button. If you haven't already, hit the notification bell to let you know when a new video is going to be dropping. Um, till next time, YouTube, Trucker Docs out.